Greetings and salutations, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Jesus Straws. In today's video, I decided I would tackle one of the things I know I need to practice more and improve on, and that's female cartoon characters. So I figured I would, you know, show you guys how my process is when going about this. I usually am still, I'm still at the point where I need references. You know, to start off a drawing, unless I do them in like a very plain, you know, stale pose, but I actually wanted to draw the hands, or at least one hand, and you know, the legs, a full body. So I found this reference on Google, just looked up female cartoon poses. And I usually just find a very basic, you know, pose, and then I kind of come up with the extra stuff, you know, you gotta make it your own, so I'll look up you know different styles of hair you know different female hair so with this one I kinda just added a beanie and then she's got long hair I usually go for a cool like urban look I don't know I usually like urban looking characters whether it's male or female so you know I'll give them piercings or like beanies or strange colored hair and stuff you know that's just the kind of stuff that I like so I try to incorporate it into the characters that I draw but with this one I didn't really draw too many piercings on this female character kind of just gave her the beanie and she, you know she's got the the blue jeans and the red chucks which you'll see as I color this more towards the end but for me these uh, females are just one of those things that if it doesn't look good I feel very self-conscious I'm like man this looks like shit you know, I could draw a doodle and I think it looks good or, you know, it could be like a shitty looking doodle and, you know, I'll be okay with it. But if I draw like a female character and it looks like shit, you know, I'm like, damn, I really need... It. It's just one of those things as an artist I know I need to improve on. So I kind of just went, tackled this and, you know, recorded it. It's, and I'm actually pretty happy with how it came out. I'm still trying to figure out my own style and, like how you know my female characters are gonna look but growing up my sister used to watch a lot of uh brats so i kind of think subconsciously brats kind of influence my the way i draw females because they have like those huge eyes they don't even have noses i think but they look kind of weird without noses so i have to draw noses on them but i think Brats definitely uh, affects uh, subconsciously inspired me to draw, you know, females that look presentable. Not so much like Barbie and shit like that. I don't really care for Barbie. But Brats was pretty cool, I guess. You know, kind of had to watch it for my sister. At least that's what I want you guys to think. Maybe I secretly actually like those movies. But anyways... Um, but yeah, with the colors, you know, I just use my basic color pencil, nothing too fancy here. It's just another page in the sketchbook here. But let me know what you guys think of this drawing in the comment section below. What kind of things do you struggle to draw as an artist? I think this and realism, even though realism isn't something that I really want to get better at because I'm not really a realistic artist, I'm more of a cartoon guy. I'll definitely post more videos of how to draw you know different poses or different girl faces or just you know eyes eyes is another thing that you know i'm still working on i'm surprised these came out the way they did i honestly thought they were gonna come out like shit but the whole drawing came out pretty good i was really pleased so let me know what you guys think in the comment section below what other things would you guys like to see me draw drop that in the comment section below too and yeah, this is our the female character. I think we'll call her. Kind of looks like a uh, Chloe, but I think I'm just thinking that now because that was one of the characters in Brad. So I don't know. Maybe her name can be like uh, Marissa. She looks like a uh, Marissa, right? But here's her and her little bulldog right here. Her bulldog could be named like Spike. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I would say personally as a self art rating I would give this a 8 out of 10 I'm actually very glad with this but for the millionth time let me know what you guys think 
in the comment section below. Drop a comment. I'm trying to, you know, bust out more uh, Tatiana's. No, I'm kidding. I'm trying to bust out more videos. So look out for that. And don't forget to subscribe to be notified when that happens. Turn on a little dingling button. Don't forget to keep creating. Spread the love. Give your mama a hug. And share this video with the homies. And till next time, guys. Have a good one. Peace.